Well, here I am. I'm with Mr. Bill Pressey. Now, Bill, you're pretty special. Going around the PGA Golf Show here in 2016, you turned my head because of this, uh, just because of this. The, the difference, the way this club, yours is called a directed force putter, mm -hmm. and this one here is called face balanced. Right. So, so we have face balancing, and then we have lie angle balancing. And we were always thought to believe that the face balance putters were balanced to be square back, square through. And if we have a toe down balance putter, that is balanced to gate or arc. Some call it toe flow. Yep. And so what I wanted to do is make a putter that stayed straight by itself. I, I kept missing putts. So the softer I held my grip, the more the face angle would open. Which now you used a zebra, right? Well, I got mine, mine right here. And this, this is my favorite, but I've, ha I've had to learn just through, through my own training mm -hmm. to control the putter face uh, below a con uh, or above a conscious level. Yes. But at the same time, the tendency is miss it to the, yeah. the right, and then you yeah. finish up aiming left. Yeah, so as a, you're a great putting coach, and you know we always want to have a fairly soft grip for good feel. We do. We don't want to have tension. We want to be relaxed. Yeah. yeah and and relax, relax body, calm mind. Right. And if you, if you tense up the body, you, you're going to tense up the mind. Correct. Yeah, you got it. So here we have, I'll just put this one right here for a second. Now here's a face balance putter. And when we take face balancing and we demonstrate it going up and down, it's very stable. Going side to side, it's very unstable. But golf is played in an inclined plane. So we'll step over here real quick. And if this is face balanced like we say it has been, I'm going to put it under this string. And when I pull this back, this should be straight back, straight through. Well, you hit, hit, you didn't hit, my, you hit between my right? feet anyway. That was a trick shot. <laughs> yeah, now you're setting up square. Real square. A uh, good chance. Miss right. <laughs> hit the back of the putter too. Now that's interesting, isn't it? So that's yeah. that's with no with no man manipulation. No no manipulation. This is free to spin. And so now what we have is my belief as a as a putting coach is that when we fit different players, they may all be different, and some people will be more upright, some people will be flatter, and that creates a different arc, steeper arcs or shallower arcs. So I I invented lie angle balancing. So we can fit to the player's arc and then balance the putter to say square to that arc. So, so it stays at right angles to the arc. So yeah. if, it's, if it's a vertical arc, it stays this way, like in croquet. Okay? Yeah. And then if it's more flat, it's going to go open, closed. Correct. That, the natural. Yeah. It, you agree? It, it won't, won't spin like that. It'll just stay at right angles to the arc, though. Yeah. There's no the opening arc. and closing. Not the target line, the arc. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm going to swing this back. And you can see in my natural arc, this is a 70 degree, that this, this putter face is going to work perpendicular to the arc. And uh, that ball hit a bit on the toe, that's why I went to the right. I'll put this cook in here, right? So we, am I under the line there? You're under pretty the line good. pretty good now, yep. All right. I can see that. So we go here. Pure. So that stays by itself. Now if we take... Uh, just, a different just, lie angle will do the same thing with a different arc. Can I ask one thing? Because the first putt, just just set up there to another ball for me, yep. and purposely hit this one on the on the on the toe of the club. We'll see what happens. This is interesting. It's the first time I've seen this, so or, or you're demonstrating. Let me swing that. Did go straight again? What happened? <laughs> the, uh, the, the the, the moment the of inertia of the arc. On the first one, I actually had the, the ground twisted the putter open just a little bit before I pulled it away. And so when we go into hitting way off the toe, the balance of this putter actually self-corrects. So we don't lose distance or direction. Can I correct one little thing there, though? Yeah. I'd like you to push it away. You want me to push it away? <laughs> that's it. You that's, our, it. that's our deal. But this, is, this, is just a, this is just a little tool that to takes, takes away any... Uh, uh, manipulation, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, Is so let's bring these back. No. Good stuff. Now, this one's fairly flat, isn't it? Yeah, real flat. 64, so it's 6 degrees flat. Now, yeah, a normal putter is 70 degrees, is it, for putting? 70. 
Yeah. Yep. And an upright degrees. one would be on the other side, 72 degrees. Right. This one's six degrees flat. Yep, real flat. For us. Yes. Us guys. <laughs> now, unless, so, you, unless you have a shorter length putter, of course. So I'll, I'll put this way out on the toe. If I go down the line, it's going to look like it's going to move more to the inside. And so if you hit a ball way out on the toe, it's probably going to move right a little bit. So you're primarily just going different golf courses. We hit it in the middle? Yeah, I've got a Spanish Country Club. I've got that one uh, Thursday. Saturday, Sunday. Middle stump. Hey. Yes. It's amazing. That putter, just, that putter head just stayed even to the arc all the way. Pretty smooth. A little block. But then it's you, isn't it? If you, you swing yeah. the putter on the right, yeah. on the arc. Now, see, just, yeah, that's fantastic. Because Mark Evershed was uh, talking about the, the, uh, the uh, for anyone that's a flat is going on the plane of the swing, you've got to keep, the putter's got to go around the arc. You can't try to steer it. No, no, it's, it's inside to square to down the line. That's a manipulated movement. When we talk about putting, it's a rotary motion. So if I if I think about the putting stroke going in a circle around our body, as soon as we add spine angle, we go down here. Well, that same rotary motion makes it still a complete arc. And it's only if I were to take a putter and pull it back and go like this, that yeah. would be essentially down the line. That's a chicken wing, yeah. Yeah, it's a chicken wing. You can tend to get the heel, shove the heel through the ball and stuff like that. Uh, so the, the, the technology of lying or balancing is all about helping your player keep the putter face perpendicular to the arc, to the arc. and allow it to be a natural swing. Yeah, whatever that arc is, we, we balance each and individual putter to match its arc. So that to me is fantastic. Uh, so that's, that, that, that is a pure balanced putter to, to make a, the, your natural swing work. Right. An uncompensating right. swing. Right. So that's pretty good. I'd, I'd, I'd like to teach people that natural swing. Yeah, that's the way it should be. Correct. Yep. Thank you, Peter. Thanks very much. Pleasure.